Hello friends, welcome to another Arduino programming lesson and in this lesson we will going to read the light intensity in the air using LDR. LDR is a light dependent resistor. For the circuit we need to have a breadboard. So here I have a breadboard. Let me just place it like this. Okay, and uh, you see I have to take this uh, LDR sensor and I will put on a breadboard something like this. Okay. This is how I'm going to place the light dependent resistor sensor. Okay, then I need a, a resistor which is a 1 kilo ohm resistor that I'm using for today. And I would going to connect the one end of the resistor to the one end of the LDR. Okay, so. Okay, so you then can see the socket properly. Uh, the connection between this one leg of the LDR is connected to the one end of the resistor because the breadboard is vertically short when it comes to the same column. Okay, this entire column is vertically short. So that is how we will going to place the LDR with resistor. Now to connect to the Arduino Uno, you see we have this A0 pin on Arduino and then we have a ground and we have a 5 volt pin, okay, on Arduino. Now to connect the socket, we need to have a 3 male, 2 male jumper wires. So I would first take the red color and uh, I would connect to the free end of the LDR. Okay, look at this because these are vertically short and this I will going to connect to the 5 volt on Arduino Uno. Okay, so this is the 5 volt pin on Arduino Uno. Okay, then I need to take the middle pin of the sensor. So where uh, our one end of the LDR will going to connect to the resistor. So the same leg where I will going to connect this um, jumper wire and then I would connect to A0 pin because that's where the, the sensor data is coming. Okay, so basically I will take another jumper wire and I would going to connect the free end of the resistor. Okay, look at this, nothing is connected. So I would, okay, because they are vertically short here. Okay, they are vertically short and I would going to connect to the ground pin on Arduino Uno. Okay, so basically the connection is, is kind of simple. The, the middle pin where our LDR and resistor connects that goes to A0 pin through the yellow wire. I can show you this yellow wire. And then the free end of the LDR that goes to 5 volt through this red wire. And that will going to connect to the 5 volt on Arduino. And the one end of the resistor, which is a free end through this green wire, it should connect to the ground pin. Okay, look at this. It's connected to the ground pin on Arduino. So this is how we will going to set up the socket. And let's not waste the time and write a program. Let me define a variable integer light and uh, this will be integer light. And in the setup function, I would going to write serial.begin because I want to use a serial monitor and it will be 9600 baud rate. And in the loop function, I would then say light is equals to analog read and because the LDR is connected to A0 pin on Arduino I would say A0 and then serial.println okay that's the uh, that's the way we will going to print the light variable value this light value will be uh, printed on serial monitor after a delay of one second so every one second or maybe a hundred milliseconds say for example we will going to print this light intensity uh, data on our serial monitor okay so uh, let me just press ctrl a and ctrl uh, ctrl t and it will align the code and then let me just make sure the board is arduino then tool is the com port is selected and let me hit upload button and uh, if everything goes well you can see lower left corner done uploading and let me open a serial monitor and you see now i'm getting a data which is somewhere 200 or something like that okay so when i um 
take my hand on the top of Ardu, um, this LDR sensor you see the value will drop it down if I remove my hand okay then it will again come back to some somewhere around 200 or something right so if I want to modify this code in a way that if the temperature drops let's say a uh, less than 100 okay then I want to turn on the LED which is connected to pin number 13 okay and by the way, on Arduino, we have a built-in LED which is connected to pin number 13, right? So let me close this, um, um, you know, serial monitor. And in the setup function, I will say pin mode. And I would say pin mode 13 number pin that I want to set up into the output mode because LED is output device. Okay, and then after this line of code like light intensity I would just say uh, if and then a block of code okay and then let's say else a block of code this is basically a syntax of if else so let me make it a little bit more clear for you to understand what's happening here right so if the light value if light is less than 100 okay then we want the LED to be turned on so it's a digital right and uh, the 13 number LED to become in high and if else if the value of uh, LDR is less than 100 that means 80 or something then we want this LED to be turn it off right so whenever I uh, cover the LDR with my hand then the brightness uh, will be reduced so it will be dark around the LDR sensor and the LED which is connect to pin number 13 will be light up okay so let me upload the code and see if it works so lower left corner you can see uh, done uploading so let me open a serial monitor to see the data so right now I'm getting 214 or something like this so when I cover the LDR sensor then you see the LED will light up this uh, this this LED on Arduino Uno right which is uh, by default it is connected to pin number 13 right so when I remove my hand the LED connected to pin number 13 will light up so if I cover it turns on if I remove my hand it goes off right so it basically detects the light intensity around the LDR and this is how you will going to read the light intensity data from your LDR sensor. I hope you will find this video educational and entertaining. We'll see us into the next lesson. Thank you very much.